no, 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 no. Not the carpet. It's clean. Hey! Kirsty. Kirsty, I said you could help, but if you're going to be cleaning, I need to be here with you. No cleaning without supervision. She's got emotional problems. Hurry up and die, Hannah. What are you playing? This. Aria Fidelphi by, um... Some guy. I don't know. I've never heard of him. Here. Take a seat. Let me show you something. Do you see this bit? It's simple. Four notes. Blake's here. Needed in the main office. Come in. My God. Erica Mason. You look just like your mother. <laughs> Last time we met, you could <laughs> barely see over the desk. I'm Lucien Flowers. I set this place up with your father. You gave me a doll when I was little. <laughs> I hope it was the right one. Did you sleep okay? I know the old place can take a bit of getting used to. I, um, don't really get much sleep. I have nightmares. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Dr. Ballard heads up our honorology department. She might be able to help you. I hope you don't mind, but I brought you something. It was your father's. Your mother gave it to him on their wedding day.
I just kept hold of it. Hey. Sorry about that. I was just getting an update from forensics. Erica, it's extremely likely whoever killed your father killed Mr. Johar. There may be some other victims as well that we don't know about. Am I in danger? All we know for sure is that whoever killed Johar has taken an interest in you. Honestly, we don't have much to go on. But Mr. Flowers has a suggestion. It might help you remember the face of your father's killer. I get flashes. Um, nightmares are uh, a silhouette of a woman with a gun, but that's it. It's like therapy. It was developed by your father and it might be able to help you with your nightmares. It's completely painless. Okay. Okay, I'll do, I'll do it. The images you're going to see are designed to relax you and open up your mind. Your father designed regression therapy to help our patients face their trauma. The first one is just a test. When you see it, just say whatever comes into your head. Hello? Okay, great. If you remember anything important, just write it down. I know revisiting trauma can be difficult, but you're perfectly safe. Let's begin. Gross. Cult. Farm. Danger. Face. Stab. Friendly. Why did you draw her, Erica? Why did you draw your mother? Your mother told me this place was her whole life. She worked here, fell in love here, had you here, later. She died here. Dr. Ballard suggested that I show you this.
Putting yourself through that was incredibly brave. It's not surprising that you saw your mother. It's a process, Erica. It takes time. I want to try again. You need to rest, clear your mind. We can try again another time. Come on. There's something I want to show you. You'll need these. Your father had the oleander planted in your mother's memory. They were her favorite. They've always brought us luck. Get off me! Leave me alone! Get off me! Sorry. Sometimes the girls have difficult days. But some of us like to keep it buried deep down inside. Anna, I didn't think you'd be up. This is Erica Mason. She'll be staying with us for a while. Didn't I bleed all over you this morning? I'm taking these to Doc Ballard. We're making perfume. Do you want to come? Uh, Fuck off! What is wrong with you? Oh, you could always go hang out with Toby. Actually, they're about to serve lunch. It's quite a spread. Why don't you go and grab yourself a bite and maybe you meet some of the other girls? Sure. Who doesn't love a good old soggy sandwich in the company of strangers? Maybe I should check on Toby. No worries. I guess I'll catch you around. Erica, it's very good of you to go to her. Just remember that some of the girls here, they can be quite manipulative. Just be careful, that's all. What are you doing? I just came to see if you were okay. You want to be friends? Is that it? It's lunchtime. Go and eat with the good girls. I'm not hungry. You're a tourist. This place has secrets. You need to be careful or you're going to get hurt. What do you mean, this place has secrets? Oh, I see. You're looking for adventure. Is that it? Fine. Come with me. Cozy, huh? Yeah. A little something I prepared earlier. What is it? Deadly poison. Jesus. It'll put hairs on your chest. Is someone sending you that guy's hand in a box? 
You're only here because you're hiding out. Who told you that? Your big news. Everybody's talking about it. Wasn't your dad some sort of genius doctor? Did he? Yes. What about your mum? I heard she died here. Did you see it? It wasn't me. The girl who drew it, she died. She used to have these weird dreams. Pink flowers falling from the sky. And she got nosebleeds. And then fits. And then she drew that. Nosebleeds? I didn't listen. Everybody thought she was crazy. After she died, I... I found that. Go on. See that symbol on the bottom? It's from an old temple at a place called Delphi. They used to get the women, drug them out of their minds. They thought they could make them see the future. The girls got sick. They had fits, seizures, and then they died. What are you saying? I know how it sounds, but check this out. There's something behind there, a tunnel or something. Granddaddy Flowers made his money <laughs> by trading futures. <laughs> <laughs>
And look what the cat dragged in. Where the hell have you been? I've been looking everywhere. You've got mail. Looks expensive. Oh, it's so pretty. Open it. Jesus, it's hideous. Be careful. was mailed yesterday. We're still trying to get a description of the sender. Here, take a look at this. That's Carl Steinbeck's place, the night manager. 